Good afternoon, uh, Berry Creek members. Uh, hope you're all doing well and looking forward to a great weekend out here at Berry Creek. I uh, just want to give you a heads up on the greens. We're 12 days past purification and the greens are healing up pretty nicely. Uh, just prior to purification, I pulled some soil and water samples, which is our normal practice. And when I got the results back from our water quality, I was shocked. Uh, bicarbonates and chloride had increased tremendously and our pH went up uh, two full points. Uh, the chlorides went from 177 to 300 parts per million, which are big red flags. Uh, but we manage the water that we have and so we're going to do something that probably never seen before. We're going to flush greens on Monday. What this involves is that we will put out some product on the greens and then water them for probably an hour at a time. And so this will go on all day Monday. Uh, you can expect that the surrounds will be really soft on the following day, so be careful as you approach the greens. Uh, but this is necessary. What happens is the bicarbonates and chlorides cause the magnesium and calcium that's in the soil profile to be unavailable to the plant and since it's unavailable to the plant in, in an insoluble form it makes the sodium with the salt go up when the sodium goes up the, the ground seals off and water doesn't go in and so long term you have dead grass and so we want to avoid that by taking this uh, somewhat drastic measure uh, but it's not an unusual thing uh, to to remediate this condition. Uh, so just be aware, as the water's running, just move past that hole and go, go to the next hole, because this will, this will occur throughout the day, so just kinda bounce around on Monday. Hope you have a great day, that you're doing well. That's all.